In this video, you learn how to draw a kitchen in three-point perspective. Perspective drawing is very easy. If you follow this step-by-step -step guideline, I'm sure you'll walk it. So, at the end of this video, if you follow each step on what I draw and you draw it on your white paper too, I'm sure this is how your drawing will look. So, let's start. Take a white paper. Uh, make sure it's a four size paper for practice as it improves efficiency. Now take two dots on the top of the page and one dot below in the center of the below page, right? And now just take straight lines meeting at the point and just all in all direction. Make sure these lines are really light so that they don't bulge a lot when you're doing the detailing part now do the same with all the points just take those points out vanish all the lines to all the points you can leave a bit of a distance between them so that you don't smudge it too much or you don't create confusion in your head yeah so that's what i would suggest like make them confident but make them light and distance so here's what we get uh basically lines that are diverging in three different points now we have to visualize the space we want to create so i've decided to create um, two pillars of the kitchen so that's basically what i'm going to cover but in a three-point perspective now i've taken these two as the corners as one corner of the room diverged it like this and now whatever is the straight points will vanish upward whatever is the height will vanish to the third vanishing point that is the one which is sitting alone in the bottom okay so whatever the height comes it's going to go up and it's going to vanish in the below vanishing point right so that's one thing that you have to keep in mind while drawing three point perspective that is the only difference the on, now the remaining two points will merge like two point perspective everything that is going to be in perspective other than the height is going to be vanishing in this way i've now created the 